Hey garden guardians, welcome to Angel Love's Garden. Peace and blessings to all. Let's get growing. Hey garden guardians, it's Angel aka Lily with a second video. Uh, part two of our seed starting video because we need to start some more seeds y'all and get ready for spring and summer so in this video um if again we're taking it back to old school previously in my old videos you'll see where i grew avocados from seed and you saw how big kata had gotten kata has not been well since probably like october um, so we don't know if Kata's gonna make it so we are going to try to regrow some more avocados okay and maybe this time we can figure out how to make them more comfortable or even maybe keep them in the house so that um, they won't get too much heat or too much coolness because some avocados are okay with the coolness they just can't drop below a certain temperature and some avocados um, prefer the heat and but they don't want to be too hot all right so what we're going to do we're using two different seeds these are store-bought avocado seeds I don't buy avocado seeds from anywhere except for the grocery store after I eat my avocados so this is a fairly big one um, I imagine one is a Haas, the other I'm not quite sure. That's one avocado seed. To me, I don't really care because I'm going to eat them whether they're Haas avocados or not. <laughs> and this is another avocado seed. I have several of them because, I, again, I have more avocados in the refrigerator that I need to eat. Um, so what I normally do, or what I've done in the past, I've done... Um, growing the avocado with water and the toothpicks that worked for me yes it did it took a while but it did work for me but with kata I just put her in some, some soil I actually kind of started her off sitting in a yogurt cup with some water um, and then she started sprouting so then I put her in some soil so let's just go ahead and put it in some cocoa core okay that's what we're gonna do with these ones I did um, take the shell off. As you can see, they look, sometimes they look different. Some of them look a little dry or whatever. But they still be growing, y'all. I don't know. I, I haven't figured out a particular trick to make my avocados grow. I just put them in the soil or the water and they start rooting. So sometimes I peel them a little bit back to see if that helps by peeling this skin off like that sometimes I'll do that because you know this is just skin on the avocado but you don't necessarily have to pull the skin off for the avocado because I've seen where it actually grows with the skin on it as well I just I, when I grow mine I tend to pull the skin off that that works for them for whatever reason all right and if you can see here even though this part is dark because it's dried out now the bottom was in water and it was still wet so if you can see the top was like this reddish and dried but the bottom is white under the, or pretty tan under the skin so the roots can still grow from this avocado even though it looks really dry, like a dried out seed. So I'm just going to peel this. And you know how we do. Sometimes we might speed stuff up and put it to music, y'all. You know how we do.
let's go ahead and put some soil in these little green containers. And I chose these little, again, I'm saved, I saved these containers. So I chose these to use because they're green. I'll remember that they're for my avocados. You can also write on these containers. Just fill them with some cocoa core. And like I said, I use cocoa core to start my seeds. That's just what I like to do. And it didn't even take like a lot of soil for it to root. Um, and I didn't put the whole seed in there. I just set the seed in the soil, which was crazy. And but Kata did well that way. Um, and Kata's little brother did as well. Um, I gave Kata's little brother to. Um, I think yeah, Kata. I gave it to my brother-in-law, and then there was another little one that I was growing. I gave it to my big nephew. So he is attempting to do that, to grow out that avocado. He actually wanted us to have a contest to see who would have the biggest avocado in comparison to Kata, which Kata is huge. But um, we're going to do this. We're going to do these ones now. So I just took, let me show you what I did. For the last avocado I grew, the one I gave to the nephew, I just took it set it like that just set it up in the soil I didn't even bury the whole thing and I put it on the grow light and it grew all right so we're gonna do that with these ones this put the bottom just set it right there and we're gonna monitor this to see if they do the same thing and even if you turn them on the wrong end, if you're not really sure if you have the right end um, pointed up for the seeds, they will grow out of the side. They will grow the, the stalk out of the bottom because I've done that too. They'll grow it out of the side, out of the bottom, wherever it's supposed to grow, it will grow out of that, okay? I've seen it done. I've done it. Um, so... We're just gonna put a little bit more of core like up around it. But not a lot because we're not covering it. We want that, that real light to shine directly on this seed. And we can do this. Put some of the little husks in there. See if that'll feed it. Because you know. Feed a plant to itself. <laughs> Why not? Let's just give it some more to break down. And I don't know why, for whatever reason, these avocados tend to like the grow light I have. It's just a little grow light I got from Walmart. And I got the little, um, the little casing from, uh, no, actually I got the grow light and the casing from Amazon, but you can find that light bulb at Walmart for like $5 or so, or it was about $5 or so. And the little casings were like 10. All right. So these are our two avocados that we are going to try to grow because we're doing part two of our seed starting video. We're starting some avocados, y'all. All right, we will keep up to date or keep doing updates on these avocado seeds to see how they grow. We're gonna put them under the grow light now and I will follow up with you on that. Thank you so much again for watching Angelo's Garden. I hope you enjoyed this part two of our seed starting video. We got some more parts to go, y'all. Alrighty. Y'all stay blessed. Bye-bye.